All right, so this video is gonna be talking about all the premiums that I got um, at the convention. Then next we'll probably do um, the RLC and stuff. Very excited to have that one. And then we'll do all the main lines. Um, but first, let's start with these F40s that I got because I forgot to mention them in the main line video. So the first one is Hot Wheels talking to this guy about Ferraris and he's like here since you like Ferraris so much take this F40 or he was like since you like F40 so much because I was telling him how much I like F40s then he was like take this one so he's like I'm not gonna complain I think I already have this one but it's nice to have an extra one and I might you know customize it or something and this one's a matchbox um it's in you know garbage condition obviously but um, I paid 50 cents for it, um, so that was pretty cool. And then this one I've never seen before, and it was $5. Um, but whatever, I'll get it for my F40 collection. Um, this one's in pretty good condition, except for a little scuff on the wing there. Alright, so... Let's start, let's start with Johnny Lightning, with this car. I paid $3 for it. I've, I saw a whole bunch of these, and I was just like, alright, I'll finally pick one up, because it was 3 bucks. And then we'll do this Hot Rod Magazine car from Racing Champions next, um, which I paid $4 for. So yeah, this Johnny Lightning... It's pretty interesting. I paid three dollars for it. Um, it comes with this. I'm not sure what it is. I guess it's a magnet or a piece of cardboard or something. It says oh, I can't read that. Uh, I'm not very good at reading cursive. In the actual car, it has surfboards. It's got two-piece plastic wheels, not rubber wheels, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Um, it's pretty cool. I like the, the top with the surfboards. Um, I don't know what the name of the car is. Um, it does have these really cool like ghost hand decals? Like it looks like it's in the dirt, but it's a very cool car. And I like it. And then next is this Hot Rod Magazine truck. Um, I don't have too many Racing Champions Mint, but this one was just very cool. Not, it was like really weird and strange, so I was like, oh, I might as well get it for $4. It's pretty cool. It's got rear details, front details, I guess the back opens up too. There we go. So the hood and the trunk, not trunk, the um, tailgate opens up. It's pretty cool. Front details, rear details. It's got like this little like step here on the side that's detailed and everything, which is pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I like the way that the hood opens and the tail opens. Also, it's just purple. And I like the color purple. Next, let's do green lights. Um, for green lights, I got this Nissan GTR. With a person and a Ford Mustang Boss 302. So let's start with this Nissan GTR. I got it for four dollars. Comes with a person. For these, you have to use a knife to open it. So let me just do that. Sorry, this might take a second. Ugh. Now you can look at my knife while I open this box cutter. Um, so yeah, this one I paid $4 for. I was just like, oh, that's cool. GTR. It costs 4 bucks. Um, I don't have... I think I've got like two green lights, so one of which is a green machine. So, trying to branch out a little bit. Get some more green lights. There's the person. Got Falcon livery. It's pretty cool. 
I like the guy. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. It's the hobby shop or something. There's the person, and then here's the GTR. It's a pretty nice GTR. Um, rear details, front details, very nice livery. Anyway, next is the Spas 302 in black. Um, cost me four dollars. So, um, I do collect the Boss 302s. I'm trying to get every Hot Wheels one. I've got like four left. And one of them is the blue RLC. I did manage to get the gold one at the convention, so that was nice. Um, and then I've got like one of the yellow ones, a couple of, there's a blue one, and then. There's one other or something. But yeah, this uh, GTR is pretty cool. I like it quite a bit. I'm glad to have it. And the guy's kind of cool. Anyway, this is a Ford Mustang Boss 302. Um, it's got an opening hood, but it probably won't stay up, so. Uh, front details, rear details, ghost flames. Matte black on gloss black. Kind of like gloss black on matte black better myself but it looks good on this car um it is i don't really like how big the front wheels are but oh well uh next let's do let's do tomica why not i only have a few tomicas so i get, thought i'd get these i got this toyota supra the new one for five bucks I got this La Ferrari for six bucks, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then I got this Diablo for ten because it's a premium one. Um, but yeah, Tomicas are very cool, and I like them. But I just don't get the opportunity to have them very much. Uh, so let's let's open the Supra first. I had them marked at ten, but I guess I. Strike the deal with him. I'd pay 15 for the Supra and the Diablo together. This wrapper is kind of hard to get off. Um, but yeah, I've been looking for a die cast of the new Supra for a while. There's the box. Um, it's a pretty cool car in real life. I've seen a couple of them. Uh, I think it's in like three. One of which was in a dealership. I got it on film. Ooh, that's a nice color. I like that color a lot. Comes in this nice little bag. We've all got suspension and stuff. Wow, that's really nice. I really like that. I don't like the wheels, t the way Tomica fits their wheels, but... I mean, it's, it's a good scale model car. I like that quite a bit. Um, I do like Tomicas because they have the Ferrari licensing and the Toyota licensing, which a lot of companies don't. So, the next one is the La Ferrari, which is also one that I've been wanting for a long time. Um, I paid, I think, 10 for this, maybe. can't remember. I just said. Um, but it's got, like, the official product and everything. There we go. I think I've got a car that is similar, that is like this, basically this exact same car, um, but in spider, spider form, like convertible, like the La Ferrari Aperta, or, or something. I've got four Tomica Ferraris that I got in a set of Tomica Ferraris, which are very nice, and this will go very nice with them. Um, I am very excited that Tomica is coming to the U.S. I hope they do more Ferraris and stuff in the U.S. Uh, I think the U.S. Tomicas are mostly in Walmarts, if not only in Walmarts. Um, so yeah, that one's pretty nice. And then this Lamborghini Diablo is pretty cool. And if you notice, Tomicas are scaled to fit in the packaging. Like this one says 162 scale. 
instead of 164th. Um, they scale to fit in the packaging. And I think this is getting really long, so it's at the 10 minute mark already, so I'm gonna um, split this part up into two or three videos, probably three actually. Um, so yeah, this Lamborghini Diablo is the premium variation of Tomica. They've got Tomica Basics and Tomica Premium, and this is a premium one, so it's got opening doors and rubber tires and stuff. Ooh, that's super pretty. I wish I could get more Tomicas, but it's hard to come by. Ooh, it's really heavy. It's got two piece plastic wheels instead of rubber wheels. But well, look how pretty that is. Wow. That's that's just a crazy car. I think the headlights look like they <gasps> What? That's so cool. Okay, look. See this little like yellow thing here? If you pull it forward and back. Look, ready? I'm gonna push it forward. The headlights come up. That's so cool. I've got the opening headlights, the opening doors. Look at that. I'd pay 10 bucks for that any day. That's so nice. Wow. That's an incredible car. So, uh, note to self, if I ever see another one of these in a different color, you gotta pick it up. That is so good. That's probably one of my favorite Lamborghinis, if not my favorite. That's probably my favorite Lamborghini that I have and my favorite Tomica. Wow. That thing is so pretty. I just want to stare at it all day. I could stare at that all day. Wow. That's super cool. And like the headlights go down and the doors go down. It's got suspension and everything. Does this one have suspension? No, it's too low. It wouldn't be possible for it to have suspension. Well, it would be, but it wouldn't do anything. That's super pretty. Yeah, that's crazy good car. But yeah, thanks for watching. Pick up one of these if you can. Some of these other ones. The GTR is pretty nice. Kind of a weird Johnny Lightning. I really like these Tomicas. I'll have to buy more. But yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video or two where we do these. Bye.